and Kumina, really, we've also continued to grapple with uh, continued bad news on the COVID-19 front, vaccines, spikes, but some positive news today out of Oxford. Absolutely. Now, the positive news that if they're able to bring about this five minute COVID test, it could dramatically improve economies around the world. But they're saying that it's not going to officially be rolled out until next winter. Now, the university says they're going to start production of the device in early 2021. And then six months later, they're hoping it will be in mass supply to countries all over the world. Now, this is particularly going to be useful in airports as well as in businesses. And going to hopefully help economies open up. We have heard even the vaccine makers say that, you know, yes, even a vaccine comes, we have to learn to live with this virus now in the days ahead. And this could very much be a step in the right direction and help to really perfect mass testing. And so definitely some positive news there. Hey investors, Zach Guzman here. Are you interested in learning more about the markets and getting the latest financial news? Well then click right here to subscribe to our Yahoo Finance YouTube channel. Get the latest up to the minute market analysis, big interviews in the world of finance and information on how to manage your money every day wherever you are.